Hello teachers, I'm Teacher Brian. Today I'm going to tell you eight common traffic mistakes here in Vietnam. The article that I'm referring to today says that one of the biggest fears of living abroad in Vietnam is driving. So this article, I'm going to give you eight common mistakes made here while driving on a motorbike or bicycle or in a car and they're going to help you avoid some unnecessary frustrations. Ready? Let's go. Number one, this is very important, drinking and driving. <laughs> Drinking and driving in Vietnam is obviously a no-no. Um, if you're going to go out in the evening time and have even a little bit of alcohol, uh, you should probably arrange for a driver uh, or a taxi. Starting in January 1st, uh, 2020, the Vietnam National Assembly uh, released a decree about the fines for drinking and driving. So drivers who violate the highest level of intoxication, which is level three, can be fined between 30 and 40 million dong when driving in Vietnam. That's over a thousand dollars. It's almost fifteen hundred dollars. Close to two thousand. It says when driving a motorcycle it can be a six to eight million dong fine. You can lose your right to your driver's license for 22 to 24 months and bicyclists are 400 to 600 thousand VND. That's about twenty dollars for bicycling while drunk. Guys, we're teachers, we know better. Don't drink and drive. Number two, using a mobile phone or audio device while driving in Vietnam. If you are listening to music or the radio uh, while driving, it's advisable for you to give up this practice. Uh, you don't really um, commit a crime, but you can get a significant fine. So it says a fine from 600,000 to 1 million VND uh, is imposed on vehicle operators using um, umbrellas, mobile phones, audio equipment, um, except for hearing aids and it can be 80 to 100,000 for bicycles, motorbikes or electric bicycles and uh, other rudimentary vehicles. Stay off the phone while driving, guys. Number three, going past the red lights. This one's actually a quite common mistake in Vietnam. Most people are busy, they're on their way to work. They don't feel like waiting for the red light so they just go through on their motorbike. If you've ever thought about doing this, think twice. The police just show up anywhere and you can be pulled over quickly. The fines for vehicles that don't obey traffic signals can be from 3 million to 5 million VND. Four, forgetting to use your turn signal while operating your vehicle. This one's pretty straightforward. You're going down the street, you change lanes or take a turn, you don't use your signal, you get the fine. And the fine for this is 400,000 to 600,000 VND. So, you know, if you would like to avoid collisions in Vietnam, make sure you use your turn signal like a good law-abiding citizen. <laughs> oh gosh, man. Number five, exceeding the speed limit. It's 40 kilometers an hour in suburban areas. It's 60 kilometers an hour on the highway for motorbikes. Wow, okay, so the motorbike fine is 200,000 to 500,000 VND depending on how bad your mistake is. But if you choose to go by car, you have 50 kilometers an hour in the city, 120 kilometers on the highway, and it can go up to 12 million dong for your ticket. Be careful with your speed here in Vietnam. Number six, piling on more than two people onto your motorbike in Vietnam. Okay, so you will likely see three or more people on a motorbike in Vietnam, but there is a fine for that if you're spotted, and that is 200 to 300,000 VND. Oh, nice, okay. So the exception to this rule is cases of having to take a sick child uh, to the emergency room or escort someone else who has committed illegal acts. Um, those things are accepted as two or more occupancies on a vehicle, motor, motorbike vehicle. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> I lost count. 
Number seven. Number seven, forgetting to bring your driver's license uh, when you're out driving. Every driver must have driving driver's license, vehicle registration with them at all times when driving. Failure to bring these are 100,000 to 600,000 VND. You cannot use a notarized copy to replace the original when asked by the police. If you don't have it, you're considered in violation of the rules. Pretty sure this is number eight. Number eight, running away from the police when being pulled over. <laughs> this is an act of disobeying the traffic controller's command. When the police detect your traffic violations on the road, they have the authority to pull you over by their hands, using a traffic stick, a sign, or a barrier. The fine depends on what type of vehicle you are using. The car is three million to five million VND if you run from the police. <laughs> Uh, your driver's license is revoked from one to four months. For motorbikes, it's 600,000 to 1 million VND, and you can have your license suspended for a time similar to motor vehicles. Man. <laughs> okay, so there are a lot of accidents daily from these eight common mistakes. Uh, if you avoid them, I think you have a great chance of avoiding accidents here and you won't have to be fearful uh, in your daily life of driving in Vietnam. Uh, this was a pleasure. I enjoyed um, reading the article to you today and have a great afternoon, teachers. Bye-bye.